I am done. I have heard this line from people saying, "Bro, I'm so done." Dude, I'm done now. What we try to say when we say this line, "I am done," is that I'm fed up of being fed up. I can't take it anymore. I can't do it anymore. I'm just done. So that's the title that I've given to today's uh, short exhortation. So before you start thinking, "I'm done with whom?" So it's not about anybody. I'm done with certain things that I used to do in my life, and now I no longer want to do it. So I'm done. The first thing I want to share today: I am done. I am done pretending. I'll repeat: I am done pretending. I could have used a little harsh word and uh, say that I'm I'm done being a hypocrite, but uh, it's okay. I think pretending is little sweet. So I'm done pretending. What exactly is pretense? When you say something which you do not want to say it, you don't mean to say it. You don't. It does not come from your heart. When you do something you really don't want to do it, you just you become somebody who you are not. That is when we say we are pretending. What are you pretending to do? Something who you are not, and that you pretend to be or pretend to become or pretend to show off. That is pretending, and. Uh, why people pretend i i have been pretending for quite a lot of time i have to confess but now i'm done pretending and the reason i found out in my life why people pretend is first they want to be accepted they pretend so that they can be accepted by other people but the problem with that acceptance it's always a false acceptance because these people are accepting somebody who i am not so in the back of my mind i'll always be thinking if they really know who who i am or what i'm thinking or what is my view point on this they will react differently they might reject me so a person who is pretending and he thinks that he is getting acceptance is actually getting false acceptance and will never be able to enjoy the true acceptance that comes from people because he is always pretending and second reason why i figured out i used to pretend so much is because to win the approval or opinion of some people you know we all have some people in our life who are uh, a little bit of authority or have an influencing voice on our life and we always want to put our best foot forward and we want to pretend and we want to show off that we are this and we are that actually we are not so to win the approval of people to be good in the opinion of others we try to pretend and where do we pretend most i have seen most of pretense goes on in public gatherings in um, weddings social gatherings community meetings wherever there are people i've seen people pretending i i quit going to some of the gatherings long back because i told my mom they all do small talks and mind talks i'll give you an example for example anybody and everybody we all keep checking facebook whatsapp we have got good videos and things and we watch them and we see them and when we go to a, a social or gathering or party we present the thoughts as if they are our own thoughts nobody is real actually so it's all pretending where people are there other people are pretending i am done pretending and how do we prepare most of uh, pretend most of the time we we tend tend to show ourselves very strong especially men you know i'm strong men don't cry who said ask men <laughs> they'll tell you i, I I'll, uh, in religious circles you pretend to be perfect oh i'm i'm perfect which you are not you pretend to know it all which nobody knows knows it also so this is a i am just done pretending now because if some people who like me i'll tell you just a short brief about what i've experienced in last 6 to 8 months i know pandemic covid lockdown lot of lives have been affected i'm not demining anything but i just want to share that these last 6 8 months from the month of march my life has changed drastically i have enjoyed this time this has been the best time of my life and i've grown so much i have learned so much I've spent so much time with myself and I found out that I'm pretty cool to hang out with and I've enjoyed my company and I one thing which I found out is that all these years I was an echo I used to hear things and hear view points and and I used to echo them out but in this last 4 to 6 months I realized that I have a voice 
and i want to tell you my friend you also have a voice stop being an echo you have a voice of your own a flavor of your own a uniqueness of your own you are a voice so be your voice and speak out your thoughts and your voice so first thing i'm done pretending and i encourage you you also stop pretending be yourself second i am done justifying myself i'm done justifying myself i divided it into two parts one i said good justifying and one i said bad justifying i'll explain in a bit what do you mean by good justifying so there are some people in our life who really love us and they are our loved ones they are close to us they trust us they're actually for us they have the right to question us and we have the responsibility to be answerable to them those are the kind of people everybody have in their lives and we have to justify or answer to them that is good justifying but i am done justifying the bad justifying where i have to justify myself to anybody and everybody let me tell you one thing if somebody really loves you and cares about you they will come and talk to you and if they are cho- choosing not to talk to you rather talking about you let them do you don't need to justify yourself to anybody because what i have learned about people everybody has a filter of perception you can say whatever you want to say people will receive through the filter of their perception because they have grown up in certain way they have a programming of their mind and they think in a certain way so what like for example right now also i'm speaking to you some things i might be meaning something else from my heart but you might be figuring out and catching something else because you are listening to me through the perception filter that you have so everybody has that perception filter you don't need to go and justify yourself to anybody and everybody you know i don't want anybody to think bad i don't want anybody to misunderstand me people will misunderstand you news flash there will be some people who will always misunderstand you quit quit justifying yourself you don't have to do that you have some people who who love you please be answerable to them but if people choose to talk about you rather than talking to you you don't need to justify yourself to them so i am done justifying uh, if somebody wants to know genuinely something they'll come to me and they'll ask me so i don't need to justify myself third i am done overthinking we all are going through this overthinking what do we call the modern day word stress is basically what it's overthinking when you keep a thought negative one in your mind in a repeat mode and you keep thinking you keep thinking what will happen tomorrow how will life be how will i catch up with my bills and what will happen and i'm just thinking about everything overthinking especially what i want to share today is i am done overthinking about what people are thinking about me if you are always thinking of what people are thinking about you then you are in a bondage i have been in that bondage for years before doing anything saying anything posting anything on social media oh what will that person think what will this person think so much thinking 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 and what am i thinking i am thinking that what people are thinking about me it's a bondage i am done overthinking 